what I'd like to do is um, I work a lot with energy and I and vibe and vibration and sensing. So with that, I also like to humanize it. So when people were always like meditate, 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 I was like no, 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 and I resisted. And anytime I resist something, I know that there's something that I don't want to see or I don't want to um, I don't want to come to my awareness. So I thought, all right, I'll start meditation. <laughs> Um, and I used to do it through just guided meditation, um, which I found really beneficial, but then I would often fall asleep um, and I'd forget whatever would come to me. So I went to last year to Deepak Chopra's Journey to Enlightenment in Queensland um, with the intention of I want to learn how to meditate silently, so with no music. Um, the very first time I got there, he put us straight into a meditation that was guided but no music. And uh, this really incredible experience happened and I think it was the experience that I was always fearing and not wanting to happen. And it was like dropping into this space and it was like someone had an eraser and just started erasing my body. And I was grasping on to not have that happen for that not to happen because I was losing complete control. Um, it was like, oh my gosh, what on earth is happening to me? And then I entered this space of this pure bliss where whatever I thought was happening in here consciously, if I thought of a sand, I would be the sand. If I thought of you, I would be you. If I thought of uh, a rose, I would be a rose. And I thought, far out, like I'm separate to no one. And at the end, you could put your hand up and ask him questions. And I ran to the microphone. And I was like, oh my God, this just happened. What happened to me? I don't know if this is normal or if I'm like, am I normal? Am I having a nervous am breakdown? I having a nervous breakdown? Um, he actually said that's the place where uh, any person in meditation, that's the highest place that you can go, where you become one with something. And I've never reached it yet, which is I was going to say, wow. <laughs> no, just got it there. And then I was like, damn it. <laughs> you just nailed that. <laughs> So anyway, that was um, frustrating because it's, it's, it's been tricky to get back there. But the way that I use meditation is to simply, in its most simple form, to clear my conscious brain, the one that just kind of goes, I'm going to talk to you, I'm going to talk at you, I'm going to override you, and I'm not going to let you rest. Um, it's that relentless kind of badgering. Um, so I choose...